George Floyd has become a political activist. But we have to remember he was a person, a father, a son, a brother, nephew, cousin, and friend. He has people who miss him today. Floyd had good days and he had bad days. One person who was there alongside him through it all was his friend, Travis Keynes. Yes, sir. Travis, thank you so much for coming on the show this no morning. Problem. I know today is, it's a tough day. It's not an easy day. No, it's not easy. The last three years have been pretty easy. Uh, you know, it's to the point where it is, we knew, like I said at first, uh, I and us as a community have to breathe for him now yeah. um, and keep his legacy going. Um, keep on fighting for this change that we are uh, doing right now, but uh, it's, it's not easy, not by a long shot. I, I want to mention, I want to tell um, our folks listening in and watching this morning, mm -hmm. you and I met back in uh, the fall of 2021. Yes. yes. And I had uh, just accepted this position here. I was not even here a month. Yeah. And mm -hmm. they had created this position. and. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, I was looking for assignments and I stumbled upon um, an article and it brought me to want to go into the third ward community Yes. to, to talk with those who knew him, mm -hmm. to talk to those who he impacted. Mm -hmm. And so we went there, my photographer and I at the time, we, we drove over there and we parked the car and we just walked around. Mm -hmm. And that is when we met you. We met mm -hmm. you on mm -hmm. uh, on one of the corners. I don't, mm -hmm. you, I don't remember which corner it was at this point. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, it's okay. It's uh, right. Across from the high school, actually. Uh, yes. I, I don't know the intersection. Mm -hmm. uh, but you and I pulled up two chairs and we had a conversation yeah. right on the curb. Mm -hmm. um, and that was the very first enterprise story, what we call enterprise stories, yes. that mm -hmm. I logged. Mm -hmm. And it was through that conversation I realized his birthday was the following week. And I believe that's yes. when the story yes. ended up airing. Mm -hmm. What has George Floyd done to this community specifically? George Floyd have brought awareness. To, it's like to be, where, to be alive and to be aware. Uh, what he has done, he has changed our community as 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 in so, so many things, so many as in like not being harassed anymore, or anything like that, you know, uh changes as a people too to 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 kind of love each other more than what we've been loving. Uh you know, standing up for what we know that's wrong. Mm -hmm. I mean, is 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 what he has done. Um the change that he has made around the world is is it's it's, he, it impacted our community more than anything else because we really knew him. We loved him. Uh, it's like I said once before, you know, and I'll keep on saying it. George Floyd was a human being. Yeah. You know, he was a, he was a rapper. He, he mm -hmm. was. Uh, I remember that yeah, was yeah, a big yeah, exactly, thing. Exactly, exactly. You know, his music, the music. He, he loved basketball. Love. He loved football. Yeah. You know, I mean, he's an athletic. You know, he was a, a mentor. He was a father. You know, but most of all, he was a human being. You mm -hmm. know, um, and we. We love him and we miss him, you know what I mean? And our job is to keep his legacy and everything going. You know, we breathe for him now. What is your hope for people um, today when it comes to this movement? You know, we, we mentioned, I don't know if we've mentioned it already, but if not, we're about to. And that is, he has become an activist. Through his death, he has become this activist. What mm -hmm. do you want people to take away from the movement that he has sparked? I want them to understand that you have to fight, keep on fighting for change. Yeah. You know, he yes, he did change the world, but to keep this change going and keep on breathing for him, that's what you have to do. You have to fight, you have to stand up. Mm -hmm. You know, and um, if we don't stand up, the systematic racism part of America right now is gonna keep on going, it's gonna get worse and worse. Uh, you have to be smart in what you're dealing with, as a black African American, yeah. I know this. You know what yeah. I mean? You have to be smart to deal You're with. Aware. You, yeah, I'm aware. You know what I mean? And uh, you, uh, it's 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 nothing easy mm -hmm. being a black man in America. People mm -hmm. who are not within that community, mm -hmm. people watching right now who mm -hmm. who are not black, what do you want them to know? We all people. We all human. Treat us like you want to be treated. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like we only human. We bleed red too. Yeah. You know, and and just take take take. Take the time to understand, you know, with, you know, the problem that we have with people with mental illness and controlled substance problems, they are people too. Yeah. 
you know what I mean, and try to be compassionate, have a compassionate heart. Yo, know, and when you see things that happen, don't engross the situation by cutting up behind it, like acting a fool behind it. Be smart at what you're dealing with. Calm down, you know what I mean? Because we're human too. What are you doing today in memory and honor? In honor of George Floyd, uh, we're going to be at Emancipation Park, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, we're going to be doing some things and just keeping myself, you know what I'm saying, occupied. You know what I mean? Keeping yeah. myself. You know, busy. Busy, you know, you know, keeping his name going. You know what I mean? Keep his, you know, they say say his name, yeah, we're gonna keep on saying his name. Yeah. And we love him, you know, so that's what I'm doing. And that community does too, I know. He's yes, like, yes, yes. He's too. very well missed, you know what I mean? Yeah. You know, uh, Derek Charles knocked a hole in us. <laughs> right, yeah. In our community man by killing, you know what I'm yeah. saying, Floyd. So, yeah. you know, uh we we keep on fighting, we keep on, you know. Uh, telling people to go out and vote, you know, yeah. make sure you get the right people in these offices to where it is uh, They can keep this change happening, you know, so that's basically it. Travis, I appreciate you. No problem. I appreciate Anytime. the friendship that Anytime. we've de de developed over the years yes, and I appreciate you coming in yes. uh, this morning. All right. Thank you, sir. No problem.